know what? I must say, Jamie had the opportunity to score. He Oi. didn't want it enough. Oi. See, you can, as you can see, uh, but I, I can't count my try. It was uh, definitely the fourth try. Although I put it down, um, the fourth had a great driving ball, and uh, credit must go actually to them. I was just uh, like a leech in the back, just holding on to it. Uh, yeah, it was a great performance in general. Uh, quite happy, but you know, this is. Uh, We'll see who we play at the end of the, the weekend. So thanks. Oh, top notch, mate. Well, last week was disappointing, so this week we're at home. We don't. We've only lost one seed before, so we love playing here. And we just like to go and try here as well. Huh? Oh, boys, a bit more direct to me. And last didn't get a point. Who's okay with these two? Oh, you real? Look at this guy, though. Like. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, boys, uh, a bit more direct and uh, got a big runners into the game, and then we got silky backs like Ashley and Stretch out there to finish it, so it's all good. Judy, how, um, how big is that for us to, to reach the finals now? Yeah, it's massive for the club. You know, we uh, we want to be in uh, the top competition in the, into the final stages, and we've done that. You know, obviously we wanted a big performance after the disappointment of last week. Um, but we got that this week and uh, you know, everyone today played really well. Sometimes it takes time to uh, build the scores and especially into that wind it was very easy you know, if we were ill disciplined just to take 70 yards and not the ball down our half. But I thought second half we showed real intent but then they had the man in the bin and we took it to them and then uh, you know the, we, we got on top of them and played really well. I think it's just a, basically a process where we had to break him down and we played him to the wind so we had to work hard the first half that competitive side and once we got the momentum and the wind with us I thought uh, we held up to the ball and we played in the right areas of the field and, and we did well. No, I think we are probably the best if not even there and uh, obviously it's going to be tougher because it's going to be a away game but we've got the potential and we played well playing away from home so hopefully we'll do the same. Listen, we're obviously very pleased with um, what happened today and, and the response that we had from, from last weekend's disappointment. Um, we were very, um, it was a six-day turnaround after after it's lose. It was a really physical, physical game difficult game and to get that kind of response. So I thought we were good in all areas today. I thought our set piece was, was magnificent. Um, obviously our attack was good, at times very good at times. And when we had to roll up our sleeves and defend against them, we, we you know we did that comfortably and put them under a huge amount of pressure today. I had a conversation with Steve Borthwick um, before the start of the match and I said in the worst case scenario that they're nine six up um, with one minute to go and we've got a penalty in the front of the post. Do we kick it or not? Because arguably 17 points would have taken us through after Northampton last night. It seems like a pretty stupid conversation to have had now. But maybe that's my job to be more anxious than the rest of the squad. And, you know, our performances prior to Toulouse last weekend, um, this performance has been coming for a long time. We've, we've played nine games in the sequence of matches. We've won eight of those games. Um, we've scored a bucket full of tries in those games. Players are confident, they're playing well. So much standing individual performances today as well. But as a response to last week's disappointment, it was perfect. We've never said we're a top two or three European side. That's what we want to be. And do I believe we can beat them on any given day? Yeah, I do. But when you look at Claremont's journey to be there, Leinster's, Munster's, it takes time. And the Toulouse team that we played against last week had more international caps than us. They had more European um, appearances than us. And I'm hoping the more experiences we have like that um, will crack one eventually, um, but these things do take some time. <coughs>